Hello, it's Gordon again, and this little video is to show you how to fix a rig onto a pole. Okay, if you come over to Redbridge Lakes, we sell ready-made rigs here. Basically, it's got the float, the shot, the hook, the line, everything on it ready to connect to the end of your pole. This is one of our little higher poles, and what I've got on the end of the higher pole is a piece of Dacron. It, that runs onto a bit of elastic, it pulls through the pole, so it <coughs> stops bouncing the fish. So, on the end of the rig, we've got a loop. We pull that off so that we can unwind, unwind the rig. There's a loop and there's a big loop there. Now we've got to open that big loop up put our two fingers through it and pull another loop through it. So what we're going to do is make like a noose effect, you see? I'll put it over the top of that there, hold the little knot on the end, pull it all tight and that is not going to come off all day long. <coughs> now there's another little loop there that I told you about originally. If you pull that at the end of the day, it will come off and you can wrap it all up ready for your next day's fishing. Now, on some poles, not generally ours, but on some poles, you'll find a little gadget here, which is a connector. Okay, so instead of having this knot, you'll have that coming out the end of your pole. And simply what you do is put the loop over there and then pull that little sleeve over there. And that does the same job. These are great, <coughs> but they have a tendency of that little sleeve either being too tight or too loose. And what can happen is that can come undone and the rig can come off during the day, or you'll find it's too tight and you'll need bionic fingernails to get the thing off at the end of the day. So that's the one I prefer but the choice is yours. That's it.